What's up, fellow journeyers? For the next four days, we're RVing in Texas smack dab on the line of totality for the 2024 solar eclipse with hundreds of RVers. We'll be grabbing a few tips on solar, eating some incredible food, checking out an all aluminum trailer, and having an awesome time. We can't wait to take this journey with you. Now we've traveled almost 700 miles from Tennessee to just east of Dallas, Texas for what will be the last total solar eclipse in the United States until 2044. Now, seven years ago, we experienced the total solar eclipse with KYD and friends in the Tetons in Wyoming. It was epic. In fact, it was so awesome that for the last seven years, we've been cooking up how we can make this an even more epic experience than last time. This time, we've invited a few more friends, hundreds more, and we're co-hosting them here with Finding Our Someday in Sulphur Springs, Texas, at a sold out rally we're calling Night Light Rally. So things are in full motion here. We've got around 50 RVs have already been parked. Uh, this is like one of the boondocking areas. And over here on this side, this is mostly water and electric. We've got, again, another, I don't know, 20 or 30 parked over there as well. But today is the big day. We've got uh, like 60 coming in all at once today. When it comes to rallies, people will show up a day or two early, which I think is smart because you can hang out, you can take your time. Sometimes you get better spots. Usually the majority of people show up the day the event starts. That's happening today. Got a lot going on. Having some barbecue tonight. Check out this thing. Morning. Smells good. Yeah, it does. And the wind was blowing it toward my RV. This thing is huge. How does it feel to be on display cooking pretty much? It's like you're even up on a stage up here. <laughs> you got the caution tape at least. So Brian and Marsh are awesome. Um, they're, they're, they're cooking barbecue for like, I don't know, 300 plus people. Man, that smells good. <laughs> so we've got barbecue coming tonight. So this campground, to be honest, it's not actually a campground. It's the civic center for the city. So the county owns that we're working with from here over, and then the school owns from there over, and then we get this parking area over here. Still a pretty good sized parking area for a lot of the boondocking we've got going on. We literally like block this off with all these gates for us, and we're starting to get people into here. I mean, it's tight, but it's not Albuquerque Balloon Fiesta tight, so. Cattle over here. <laughs> That's right, you gotta keep them fenced in. <laughs> is this the Airstream one? No. Or this is this, this is one, one you worked this out? This one I built. So it ties back underneath quite a ways, and then it also ties back here on the, and underneath that bumper, there's a two inch angle iron. That's great. And I've had it on there for six years, hauling these bikes. Oh, wow. So we were parked here with Finding Her Someday. Uh, we're not only both at the event, we're both co-hosting and heading up the event this is like the central hub for all outdoor activities <laughs> check-in starts 10 a.m we've got a volano and a scamp coming in already but let me show you the main reason we booked this facility so this is the arena civic's main entrance over here this is where the magic's gonna happen <laughs> main entrance registration check we're ready so we have a ton of incredible sponsors uh, this is our list of sponsors that are a part of this event and we appreciate grand design being the main sponsor for the event and this is what we're calling grand design row this is the main area for uh food festivities how's it going miss kelly we good so you're gonna do a table around the back side we can do the u staging big yeah kids. awesome so that's the main gathering area for like you know the talks and the meals and all that but then there's gonna be times we meet in this other area let me show you this but yeah this is the arena and we'll look at this in a few minutes well, look at these people who have been here to perform in this arena tracy lawrence reba mcintyre george Strait. Tim McGraw, Boxcar Willie here. <laughs> this is so fun. Oh, if you've ever seen the movie Eight Seconds, and if you haven't and you don't want to cry, don't watch it, but yeah, he wrote here. Here's the score sheets. There, Lane Frost right there, Oklahoma. Charlie Daniels, Alan Jackson. Garth Brooks is here in 89. 12 bucks for Garth Brooks. Where they performed, it's through here. In the arena. Look at this. Wow. So this is gonna be full of stuff later. I can't wait to show you. Right now, tonight, we have the cornhole tournament going on. So that's all that's set up for that and then a fire pit, but some pretty cool stuff going on here. Now this is the giveaway tent and people are saving up tickets until the end of the event and they can like exchange those tickets in and try to win certain prizes out of this tent. But we have a lot more stuff to give away than this. We have $36,000 in giveaways at this event. <laughs> so, and the way we do our giveaways, um, we, we like to reward people as the event goes on uh, for being involved participating and doing awesome things and so as people do um you know the cornhole tournament that's going on tonight or they do the karaoke or they come to the solar seminar like they they get entered for other large giveaways along the way these electric bikes right here i mean these are part of the giveaways going on too so i mean we have things like spread out throughout the event as well and then we have sponsors that are sponsoring like certain portions of the event as well like matt's rv products uh, their product liquefied and they're the sponsor ironically for the barbecue night so it kind of 
ties in together or whatever. Um, but yeah, we gave out one of these uh, to every single person that came to the event. Easier to use than like the powder or something like that. Uh, it smells great. You know, we've been using it. But yeah, if you're at the event, you got a free bottle. But if you want a free bottle, you can get one too. Head to liquefiedrv.com slash free bottle. And um, you don't have to have a barbecue night to try this out, but um, <laughs> you can get a bottle and you can try one out too. Got our shirt on. I love it. Oh. Got it. <laughs> of course I'm gonna <laughs> This is where they'll come in and register. All right, so registration here. So we got all the... You all put the, the ugly ones at the back. All right, we're making our way there. The all right. Yeah. And Lindsay herds us this way. Get to going. You need to get this shut up. Yeah. yeah. Registration. This is our spot. How you feel so far? Feeling good. Oh, While wow, Lily's running, she's <laughs> good run. <laughs> Why was that so funny? <laughs> the side of my brain that controls uh, cohesive thoughts is still recovering from Africa. But how you doing? <laughs> but uh, physically, I feel pretty good. It's a good thing I'm not getting on stage here in a few minutes and. Um, Talking about some stuff. Seventeen hundred. Twenty five hundred miles. Twenty five hundred? Okay, hold on. In the arena, cornhole tournament, full swing. Dave's in charge out here with the referee. <laughs> so that's what's going on inside the arena. Outside, we've got this going on. So we're heading into downtown Sulphur Springs. We've heard of three things that people say you need to check out if you're in Sulphur Springs, or at least in this area. Number one, they said you have to check out the Mexican restaurant. Number two, they said you need to check out the courthouse downtown, it's incredible. Number three, they said, you gotta check out the bathrooms downtown. I don't know what that means. We'll find out. It was called Supreme, I'll give it, a, it, 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 it is. Super good, totally agree. Is that good? Oh yeah. What I've been looking forward to. I've been holding it all day to go in that thing. It's got to be ventilated pretty well, I'm assuming, right? You can't see her. And those are real toilets. I was scared. Those are real like, toilets. I was scared they were going to be like pit toilets. Everybody kept talking about you have to go downtown and see these see-through bathrooms. So. They're obviously not soundproof. I can hear reflection. <laughs> it's definitely not. I'm really trying to keep turning. So behind turning. these mirrors is the bathroom, and you like can see out, but they can't see in. Why not? It looks like people can see. Okay, here we go. My hands. Uh, oh, honey, I can't see. This is wild. Holy cow. <laughs> so like, you are able to see all around the square. See these people sitting here playing chess while you go to the bathroom. Why is this so entertaining? I have no idea, but all right, I'm gonna turn this off because I have to uh, have to have the full experience. JJ, get on the toilet. He's on the toilet, Hensley. Look at this courthouse. Wow, that is incredible. What a square. I think there's like 15,000 people in this town. This is, look at this, wow. So a lot of things have aligned with us having this event here. Stuart has been working with us and working with others and done a, goodness, I don't even know how many solar installs at this point. Right? So we partnered with Signature Solar as one of the sponsors here at the event. And uh, they are giving away, between them and Thompson RV Services with Stuart, a $15,000 package. <laughs> if you come to the Solar Talk with Signature Solar, you could win a $15,000 install today. So everybody is here learning more about solar. They've got their notebooks. We're giving out tickets. Um, somebody today is gonna win that install. 
pretty, pretty epic. This is our opportunity, finding our someday's opportunity. I know they view this the same way. This, this is our chance to say thank you. You know, all the contacts we've had in the past with all the different people we work with and sponsors and connections, and we're like, hey, we want to love on our community. We want to give some stuff away. Do you want to be a part of that? And so many have stepped forward and say yes, absolutely. And so, you gonna win? Okay. I need to quit talking up because nice. somebody's. We're gonna have a. Was that over there? That's nice. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I think that's the table that keeps winning all the stuff. That's true. <laughs> we look at solar a lot different than most people. We like to uh, reach out and kind of ask you guys what you're, want, what you're wanting. You need two things to create power. You need bolts and you need amps. What's changing for this year or what's new or what's like the most pressing yeah, stuff you think you hear over and over? Yeah, I would say solar generators. That's where a lot of innovation seems to be getting pushed. Yeah, so you think more and more people... Uh, could probably get by with that that don't know it and that's kind of well, the, you know, the main push, piece of education. I, I push more people to solar generators than having them pay me to put a hard wired system in. You know, it's my no. horrible sales tactics. <laughs> uh, Honesty, right? <laughs> oh man. What are we doing here? <laughs> we are packing backpacks. They have an amazing program here through Can Help where kids that need school supplies so all the school supplies were bought it's based on grades we're gonna pack it up and each kid will get a backpack with all their school supplies for next season it's not a video to you yell at somebody <laughs> ready to stuff some backpacks yep yep hey buddy i love you mm. welcome everyone to the serve of purpose Rally. Yellow, yellow, yellow. I only know yeah. yellow, not yeah. yellow. I only yellow. know yellow. Rain, 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 rain. 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 <laughs> you gotta speak southern, or I don't know. Yeah, yellow. So what are you doing over here, Hensley? I'm I'm writing a card for the sick people. Oh, believe in yourself. I love it. Never give up. Yep, that's good. good. I believe in you. So this is a table for when they kind of get done or if they went to on the side, they're making cars. Who is this for? This was for kids that are sick? Yeah, kids, there's a children's hospital. Oh, there's a children's hospital here? here? That'll mean a lot coming from kids too. JJ, are you doing a card? This one's a Ah, I love it. Get well soon. Love JJ. Just think there is something so bonding about serving together. I don't know what it is, but people that serve together just connects. Relationships are being made while the community is being served. It's just such a beautiful thing. You gonna do a bag, buddy? You got it, buddy? Here. Here you go. Right, there you go. Remember, don't eat the don't eat the glue. <laughs> I actually I think I did that when I was younger, but that explains a lot. Yeah, it explains a lot. I got you. Look at all these backpacks. So if you're enjoying watching this event, you're thinking, man, I wish I could be in an event. <laughs> <laughs> We've got a great announcement for you. We have uh, our LJMJ huddle coming up, our big one, uh, mm -hmm. October 28th through the 31st. We're gonna be having this event at the Ridge outside of uh, Pigeon Forge near Gatlinburg in the fall, which is incredibly beautiful. My favorite time of the year. If you want to connect with other RVers, head over to teamjourneyhuddle.com. And even if you don't have an RV, because we have limited RV spots for this, but we also have options to stay in a tiny house or mm -hmm. the safari tent, which They're we cool. have done. <laughs> Super cool. It's going to be amazing. We cannot wait to connect with you there. Tonight is probably my favorite food night of the event. That's potluck night. Everybody brings their favorite dish. Oh, and it's even in addition to that tonight, we've even added on a chili competition. So, chili cook-off. Chili cook-off. It gets intense in the competition because it is good. It's a lot of food. What's up? Hi, Daddy. Hey, girl. Cook-up chili. I'm about, to enter the, I'm about to enter the contest here in a minute. You wanna see what kind of chili I got? You excited? You're about to see my chili. I'm gonna be on the end right next to Mr. Corey over there. Okay. You made chili and you're tasting chili? No, no, no. This is his private label here. I already, yeah. That's Nathan's. Yeah. Well, I don't wanna make sure there's plenty for everybody else, so I don't wanna eat my own chili. I'm pretty sure that came from my rig. Ha <laughs> probably did. So what do you have in your chili? All right, so this, it's an old family. Don't pay attention to what's on the label. That's not what's actually in here. <laughs> chili cook-off. Which one's the best? None of them. Uh oh. None of them Yankees know how to make chili. Remember, this is Texas. I'm from Texas. So in Texas, what is a chili supposed to be? Beef, brisket, beans, 
Regional chili. Spice level. Spicy, not spicy? You, you should be thinking you're going to have a party act. <laughs> oh, that's good. Okay. Wow. Looks like you're trying them all to mine. I don't know what your problem is there. I want an honest judge. If Corey's won, I want to hear that Corey's won. Let me taste it and then I'll get my real taste. Very beefy. There's like 12 pounds of brisket in it. Corey's did not win. <laughs> I mean, it was good. It's the taco one that I like the best. But he doesn't like tacos. Right. At least that I trust. I have not gotten any votes yet, Hensley. I need you to vote number 16 oh, you can't. Oh, you're for this. Down. There you go, Corey. Do it. No, he's for him. I'm trying to simple. There you go. There you go. Let's do it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, uh, it's amazing. It's a family recipe, and I just happened to pour it back into a can. I see. I see. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good try. It's meant to. There we go. See? Oh. That's delicious. Look at this face. See, look at that. You gonna eat it, Marissa? Um, I think I'm full. <laughs> sweet to chunky to vegan to sweet and spicy. And she said this deer had to be in Michigan to be considered Michigan venison, so. They're washing the dishes. It's awesome. Teenagers. Okay, special treat tonight. It's karaoke night, and I heard we had a couple of special guests coming in to sing for us. And if you participate in karaoke, you will get a very pretty little purple ticket that will enter you to win one of the electric bikes. So yeah, today is the big day. It's Eclipse Day. So here's what we're looking at today. It says 0% chance of rain, but it says we could get half an inch of rain. I'm not sure how that works, but what I'm looking at is the cloud cover from hour to hour. We want this one o'clock span to be clear and it is partly cloudy around the one o'clock span. So there is a chance today. I'm hoping that the sun comes out to play today because it's kind of a big deal to see the sun during an eclipse, but hopefully at least we'll get to experience the darkness, which is this a super cool part of it, but I'm hoping. Kicking off with donuts, we have a carnival. <laughs> We're talking like popcorn, cotton candy, inflatables, the whole deal. And then of course the Eclipse viewing party. And then after that, we have a taco dinner. And then we have a birthday party for Hensley after that. Celebration with her, um, she's getting into double digits at 10. 10 going on uh, on 25 already. So <laughs> she's, she told me she's an adult, she'd make her own decisions. So there's some of that going on already. <laughs> I thought that was like, I thought that didn't happen until like 12 at least. It's science. Oh. Chocolate, 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 chocolate. So colorful. I know. I like how much variety there is. Yeah. You got your dream in the arena, Corey. Okay, when we were scouting the place, <laughs> I kept on talking about the arena. He's like, shut I up. knew he wouldn't let it go. The arena. <laughs> We showed up to check this place out and you know, we knew where the dinners were gonna be and all the nice stuff. And then Corey's like, we need to have everything else in the arena, man. The arena's where it's at, <laughs> everything. And I'm like, we don't need to go in there. That's like where they, they rode ro rodeos. And it's, we're in Texas. It is. This it's is awesome. It's it's a good call. If he had his way, we'd be eating breakfast out here, do everything out here, I think. He loves we, this place. We, we, tents. That's right. We would park the RVs. We'd come through this entrance over here and park the RVs in here. Well, we joke that if it if we do get a tornado or hail tonight, all the trucks are coming in here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I don't know, dude. That looks pretty intense. Jess is going to go? I'm not racing. No, last time I challenged her, I like tore my ACL. <laughs> I'm totally pushing your wife down. It's okay. Yes. On your mark. Get set. Go. 
Dimitri. 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 <laughs> Sorry, we don't have to show this. <laughs> it's getting shown. <laughs> There's like a hundred plus RVs here at the rally. So of course we love RVs. So if we see something that looks different, <laughs> we want to show with you guys. There is an all aluminum fifth wheel over here. We're going to check it out. Good morning. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Thanks for having us. Oh, absolutely. Hi. The ceiling hot. Yeah. We choose to put our Jeep in the back. Oh, now I'm a fan of that. What makes this special? Because I'm new to this. Totally aluminum. Oh, there is no wood. There is no steel. That is all aluminum from here back. I added this, um, you know, this puzzle foam thing mm -hmm. and then put the mat from ATC back over it and then added my own Amazon rug. These tables, there's one in the back also. They, you can see, are, are hooked on airline track also because there's uh, a track on each side. Yeah. They can be moved anywhere along the wall. This couch is on the airline track also. The couch um, is on the track? Yeah. Yeah, it folds yeah. up flat. And you can move it anywhere you want. Yeah. That's awesome. One slide in here looks like, and then what? one slide in the bedroom we'll see in a second. This pantry is really big, even though it might look like small doors. It's oh, like, wow. Yeah. It's deep. The build is one thing. You love that it's aluminum. Yeah. I know it's part of it. And then, But do you like this blank slate back here? I guess you're really loving this, Absolutely. I think, sounds like. It comes with aluminum lightweight panels that clip Oh. And so you can have a petition in here. Oh. It makes it cool. Yep, and with a with a it's with a door, door, and you can put the petition there, or you can put the petition here. Wow. We chose to leave the petition home because it's just the two of us, and we want it wide open. Wow. Here. This folds down to make the full. That, that's either a patio or yeah. a ramp, obviously. Oh. I love this floor. Yeah. It, Very durable. It, it, you can, including this floor and the rugs back there, you can uh, take your things out and just hose oh, or wow. power wash the whole wow. thing out. When you can hose your house out, it doesn't get any better than that. It really does. It. <laughs> oh yeah. Um, Check it out, man. Well, it's cool. Cool. I think it's very roomy. Shower bar pops out. Yeah, so it gives you a little extra room, yeah. whichever way you want it. So much aluminum. I thought we had a lot of aluminum in the Airstream. Yeah. <laughs> there is hookup for washer and dryer in there. The entire closet. So a lot of them, they put a giant TV right here, and you lose like half your light. Yeah. But they I made like the choice. The light. This is kind of what we would love to go what? for. Why do you need a TV when you could be staring out at something beautiful, you know? That's cool. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen an aluminum sliding door. That is legit. Thank you. <laughs> Look at all this. <laughs> Relaxing and just put <laughs> multiple telescopes. I think we can see where the action's gonna be right up here. Coolest thing, though, to me at least, is that we're taking the image we're seeing here, or the video we're seeing here, and we're gonna stream it to this TV. If people don't feel like putting their glasses on, they can look at the TV. You know, we're gonna stream it from NASA if we have to, <laughs> but we'll see. Uh, we got our fingers crossed. I don't know, it got pretty thick right here. Wow, that's, that's pretty thick. Oh, so we have multiple festivities going on at once. Uh, we got Brian Marsh over here. They got more, um, <laughs> got the smoker going again. Everybody's heading this way. Hey, hey. So a lot of people have already kind of claimed their seat for Eclipse over here. But at the same time as the viewing party that's going on, we have a carnival going on in the arena behind here uh, that I've already previewed myself getting whooped, <laughs> whooped at with the ninja race. So. <laughs> 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 you gonna get some cotton candy? I don't know how you guys can do it. Meaning, enjoy the event. Oh. And still be behind the video camera. I think part of it is we've we've done it so long. Every once in a while, I'm like, okay, we're putting the camera down today. We're not gonna film. And then something really cool happens. Yeah. And I'm like, I wish I had my camera. That <laughs> seems to how it goes. It, it smells like a carnival. <laughs>
These are like the coolest machines I've seen in my life. Wow. Oh, you did. did you prepare them the way you like? <laughs> yeah, like we got your all beef hot dogs here. <laughs> Look at the ninja run line. Go. Whoa. <laughs> go, go, go. Oh, there's a chunk out. I'm such a nerd. I love this stuff so much. I'm getting chills seeing everybody. Is it on the telescope? On the stream? Oh, yeah. That's the telescope. That's live from. Oh. From so one cool. of these telescopes. That is so cool. Instead of putting your glasses off and on, <laughs> look at this seat. This suit. Best yeah. Seat That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> you good? You got on your iPad too with yours? You got the digital one right here. I got the That's digital. That's doing one. really well. Look at that. That's so awesome. Did you paint anything, buddy? Did you get anything painted on your hands or your arms? Oh, you got it. It's on your face. That's so cool. I love Eclipse. You love Eclipse? Mm-hmm. I'm going to show your chairs. <laughs> Just because I'm obsessed with chairs. Look how small these are for you. I know. These are the best. That's awesome. They just fold up. Yeah. Backrest. Bring this out. It's like a full director's chair. And those are like Take a, a good distance between the two as well. Ah. <sighs> I do like that. It's not bad, is it? Yeah, you got a cup holder, a phone holder, tray Ooh. space. Oh, another side one too. A little saddle bag. A little saddle bag on the side. All right. And they save space. Yeah. Well, part. that's what I like when they double fold. Yeah. Like to see something that small. We want to welcome you to the Lippert Love Seat Lounge, sponsored by Serve with Purpose and powered by Lion Energy. The live feed that you guys are watching on the Furion TV is actually being projected live from the telescopes. So we're super grateful for our sponsors for being able to allow us to do this. In 2017, when we witnessed the eclipse, I had no idea it was going to be as cool as it was. I thought, oh, wow, that sounds pretty neat. Like, let's see that. Right? It's about to go. Wow. There it goes, Hensley. Look. It's about to get dark in the middle of the day. Isn't this crazy? Isn't that crazy? Oh, it's like on its sliver. Look how dark it's getting. Oh, look, look at the sunset. Look at, sunset. look at that. Wow. Check that Whoa. out. Look at the sun. I've never seen that in my life. Oh my goodness. After it was over, I looked at Nathan and I said, that needs to be an event right there. <laughs> that was so cool and we got to experience it with others on top of um the mountain and grand tetons we were so bonded after that because it's just an experience i think everyone should witness and together the journey is better together right i look out and see this sea of all these amazing people and this is just more than i ever could have hoped for <laughs> thank you guys Tripod, tripod, tripod. There it comes. Tripod. <laughs> so the next eclipse that's happening in the U.S. is in 2044. So in 20 years, one of those moments where you realize the age you'll be if you're blessed to see another one. You're like, wow, Hensley will be 30 years old. And JJ will be 25. Wow. I don't want to say how old I will be. You'll still be 29 no matter yeah, what. Yeah, so. I'm always 29 at every age, so there's that. I'll be 29 the next eclipse, Hensley. We're about, what about, maybe 60% right now? And you can already and look the at the light. light just changed. starts, come, I mean, I'm getting chills because it's like a light that you've never experienced. It's not, it's different than dusk. It's, <laughs> it's really cool. We, we look really good, Marissa. Yeah, is it good lighting? It's really good, Maybe yeah. we should have done a photo yeah. shoot. Who's excited? We all are. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is this y'all's first eclipse or have you yeah. seen one? Yes. First, 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 first time or <laughs> what are you most excited about? Being here with all you. Oh, oh, we're a dark, we're a cult. <laughs> you had to say that. You had to say that. I did not pay them to say that. <laughs> Feel it getting colder, buddy? What are you vlogging it to? This temperature definitely dropping, the light getting changing. colder, yes. I remember when we did this in 2017, remember all the cheering we could hear from people far away? It was, it was coming wild. to us because we could hear cheering coming. It was wild. Back, back then, we could hear the animals literally like, everything just stopped. All the birds stopped chirping. They were very confused. Yeah, all the animals were confused. You know, it's up here right now. We got a huge gap right here. I think it might work out. I hope so. There's an actual sunset happening. An actual sunset? Look at this. Look at that. Wow. It's glowing. 
<laughs> it's pink. Oh, oh my god. god. It's the oh, it's so close. The clouds it's starting to get dark. It's starting to get so dark. It's like lightning. It's trying to like bring up the exposure. One minute until totality. Keep your glasses on until we give the announcement that it's safe to take them off. It's getting dark. <laughs> JJ, it's getting dark, dude. I mean, look, I did. When I whip my glasses off, then it was. Oh, it's about to go. 30 seconds. It's about to go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. You're at 10. Ready? 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Total. <laughs> I know, isn't this wild, buddy? Yeah. That, that's so awesome. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is so awesome. Oh my gosh. Look! <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh wow! <laughs> I don't know why I'm like sobbing. No, no, I'm so cool. So wow. Uh, <laughs> I can't see what I'm I mean, you can't even put it into words. You know, it's like, what is it like 1:30 in the afternoon right now? <laughs> it's wild. JJ, look at the moon. Uh -huh. The moon is taking the sun away. <laughs> the moon is taking the sun away. That's exactly right. It's exactly right, buddy. That's so cool. Look wow. at that. Wow. So you're getting some of the flare too. Start. It's wild. I love eclipse. <laughs> to have four minutes of totality. Yeah. Last time wow. we only, only had time, yeah. half that. Can you guys see the stars? Feed. That is live feed right now. There's a star, star right over here. Yeah, that's cool. Thirty seconds left of totality. I don't want it to end. I know. I don't want it to end. <laughs> I said I don't want it to end. <laughs> Oh, uh, the clouds are really cool. No, wow. The clouds Dude, really the clouds add to it. Really added to I, that was a way, that's a way different experience than last time. Three, two, one. one. Glasses back on. Wow, look at that. Look at that. That opened up. Wow. Oh, wow. Woo! Oh, better together. Better together. That was awesome. Yeah, absolutely. I think our viewers, I, I, I would say human beings connect to experiences. That's my, my take anyways. Um, but I feel like our viewers are a group of human beings. They're a group of human beings who... He's probably saying better stuff than me. <laughs> but our viewers are a, that group of human beings who are willing to take those risks, to be uncomfortable, to sometimes venture out in the unknown because they know that connection happens through experiences. And that's exactly the goal of what we did here. We want people to connect through an experience. <laughs> Is that incredible? Oh yeah. I am so glad we I know, I was looking, I was gonna like, hit that break at the perfect yeah. time, it did. Oh my goodness. Okay, our day here is not done. Uh, we're gonna wrap up the rest of the rally. We've got a taco dinner coming up. We've still got a couple more hours of the carnival going on with all the games and festivities. And then we got a birthday party for Hensley and then we're gonna celebrate together with her turning double digits with 10. I said it's the best day ever when you have an eclipse and tacos. So we're super thankful for RV Mattress for sponsoring our dinner tonight. I'm telling you guys, you've heard me talk about my mattress before, but game changer, life changer, having this mattress, I'm, it's just been, why did we wait so long? I'm gonna put our link below in the description. If you wanna check them out, they're offering great sale. You can head to rvmattress.com slash less junk for journey. And I'm telling you, you'll thank me later because what? That's all I can say. You'll thank me later. The moment we've been waiting for, $15,000 in a solar install from Signature Solar and Thompson RV Service. Okay. 070860. <laughs>
Whose birthday is it? Mine. What? You ready to come celebrate? Yeah, I can't. Uh,